with me after he um, um, went over PCHS and uh, kind of you get into the key part of the season now the, the, um, where you want to be playing playing your best and um, you really haven't had many practices with everybody there have you? Well I mean it's been uh, since before Christmas uh, that we've had what I would call our, for our starting five together and uh, so th this time of the year it almost feels a little bit like preseason because we went from Christmas until now, and then suddenly we got hit by COVID for a couple of kids, and then somebody got injured, and always seemed to be some reason why we couldn't really put the, what I consider the first five out there. So Pink was last week, and then this game tonight's for the first time that they've actually played together this year. And so it shows at times. We play really well for stretches, and then all of a sudden it looks like preseason, you know, like we're kind of learning all over again. Uh, so that's kind of where we are right now, but we got – you know, the rest of this week and into next week to try to work out some of the kinks and get things where we want it. I mean, obviously you didn't want Will out during that time, but in a way that might have kind of helped give the other guys confidence that, that you know, when he got in foul trouble today, I know he did it against Stearns too, kind of give them confidence that they can step up, huh? Well, I mean, I think that, you know, this this particular group already, they kind of already know that. I mean, I think they, uh, you know, teams would be... Uh, they would be making a mistake if they think that Will Kuzniers is all that we have because we've got other players that can play too. Uh, the question is that, you know, we'd be foolish to not have Will Kuzniers doing a lot of things for us because he's a talented player. Uh, but Will is so unselfish, I mean, to, to a fault uh, sometimes where it, it's like, you know, keep the ball and try to do something with it yourself. But he wants to dish off as much as he wants to score. So uh, it's nice when you have a centerpiece like that and then you've got to put the pieces around him. Uh, that's kind of what we're working on right now, and I think we have them. I think we have the pieces, and like Bryce is a good example tonight. He showed you what he can do. Mm. Um, you know, if he if he had to, he would. You know, but we just try to play within our framework and do what we need to do for us. Mm. Uh, and if that means uh, Will Kuzniers scores 30 and Bryce scores two, that's what we do. Mm. The next night, it's Bryce scoring 25 and Will Kuzniers scores two. That's okay too, because mm. the W is what we want. Mm. And, um, you know, you got the experience. They, they have the experience, a lot of these kids, from winning on the football field. You got the experience from winning two years ago. Um, you're the defending champions. And um, how much does that help you going into tourney time? Well, I mean, I think the kids are, expect to win. They're winners. You know, they've won a lot in their careers. And uh, that involves uh, Avery, you know, as a football player. Bryce is a football player. Will on the football team this year and whatnot. So, we, you know, we, th those kids expect to win. Yeah. And um, lastly, you know, you good win tonight you got a big stretch coming up you know you got a lot of heel points coming up with central and penobscot valley um game games this week what do you think your team's mindset is and finally get a, like a full practice tomorrow right yeah and well and the idea is to just kind of get it rolling in the right direction get some momentum going mm -hmm. uh you know so obviously like you say we got some tough games coming up some really real challenges but at this time of the year that's what you want because when you get to the tournament there's no easy ones they're all tough yep. so if you're if you're going there with an expectation to win the thing which is what we're going there with mm -hmm. uh and why would why would you have any other expectation you know we want tough games we want to play tough opponents and we want to play well against them so we can prove to ourselves that we're ready for that excellent well I thank you we'll see you next tuesday at foxcroft and good luck the rest of the way yep.